I really need to do something about this terrible lawn. I've ignored it for months and it's grown up to the point where I don't even know if I can mow it anymore. There could be anything living in- <laughs> Okay, I'm exaggerating. The grass isn't quite up to my chest, but as you can see, it is completely overgrown. And today is the day when I'm finally gonna do something about it. I don't even own a lawnmower at the moment. I've gotta to go to a pawn shop or something and buy one. The neighbor's offering me his ute very kindly. Look, the dog just disappears. There you are. <laughs> I don't know what's living in here. Generally, I'm concerned about that. Just before I started filming a minute ago, I saw this little slithery thing. I hope it was a lizard, but it could have been a baby, baby snake. Whoa. <laughs> Let's follow Saza. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Come on. Where are you going? What have you found? Do I want to know? Where's his poo been getting done? I haven't seen one of his poos for weeks. We normally pick them up every couple of days. You, you just can't even find them in this. It's going to be a really tough day, guys. Wish me luck. Okay, we are locked and loaded, ready to head to the tip first, but I don't think I've got any cash. I've got a mattress, as you saw, that needs disposing of. Um, and then I've got to go and buy a new mattress because my parents are coming to visit in a couple of weeks and we want them to have something clean and fresh to sleep on. So this one's for you, mum and dad. some mowers here already. This is the mower I've bought. No idea if it's a good one or not, but it was pretty cheap. Victor, I think they're good. I also got a whipper sticker as well.
Oh, you're a chatty man, aren't you? Really? Is that right? It's the job that never ends. You're on your bike. <laughs> She's off. So Lola was allowed to take anything she wanted from the fridge. What did she choose? She chose an apple. The healthy option. Very good, Lola. We're very proud of you. Oh. <laughs> All right, so it's the afternoon again. The heat of the day has gone past, so I'm gonna go out there and oh my God. What is this? Have you? Did you know she was? I gave her a yogurt <laughs> snack and um... <laughs> oh, oh. Are you having fun? That is the main thing, Lola. Are you enjoying that? Yes. <laughs> yes. Dad again. It's all in your head. So Look at her belly. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Oh, are you giving yourself a yogurt paste? What do they call them? A well, yogurt like body paint. <laughs> Mum to the rescue. As always. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I think we're a little bit past our arrow. <laughs> it's a bit late for uh oh. Oh, yeah, there's a little bit on your shorts. <laughs> she, she's complaining about a, a little spot on her shorts. <laughs> there. <laughs> Look at the state of you. So it's now late afternoon, early evening, day two, and I have finished. I didn't film myself doing any more because I think you've seen enough of me mowing. But here we go. Our new lawn. Pretty good, hey? So much better than what it was before. At least now you can actually walk on it. <laughs> and uh, Lola can play on her slide and stuff, so. We've got a garden again. And I'm really glad that I got around to doing this lawn because the neighbor just came over and he's been doing his garden. And he said, just to warn you, we found a snake over in the, in the corner over there, a little brown snake. Those are the really nasty ones. So it's a good thing that we've got short grass now with this one to keep an eye on her. Hey, Lola, sandpit. One, two, three. Typical, right? More, more, okay. Oh, oh, oh. Let's do another one then. You've got to fill it up. 